Um, what are what are the most dense foods? Where which are the ones that are going to give you the most bang for your buck? They have the most nutrients in them. We've probably gone over some lists with you, people who come to these regularly in the past. So you probably have some information on that. Um, I'm not really going to give you another list like that tonight. You already have should have that. What I'll do is tell you that when people study the amount of good things in something versus the amount of calories it has, so you want more good stuff and less calories. Leafy green vegetables always win that battle. So your lettuce, your spinach, your kale, all this stuff, you know, some stuff we have over on that table. Those are going to be the things that give you the most of what your body really needs and it's really deficient in it. It needs you to nourish you and it's going to give you the least amount of calories while you're getting those. Um, that's important because anything ever studied on nutrition is very clear that the, the more excess calories or energy is put into the body is bad for it. So it will decrease your longevity. Um, now that's not to say that if you ate nothing you'd be healthy. You'd starve to death, right? So you need to get what the body requires but not get excess energy stores and things that your body has to store and accumulate all throughout it. You need to get the nutrients, um, you need to get enough of those, and, and then move on basically. So enzymes. Here, here's, a, here's a big big point on this. When you're juicing, you're putting, really think of it like putting life into the body. 